What happened to everyone? Why is everyone so sensitive, so triggered, and so easily offended? What the hell happened? I mean, I've touched on this before, but it hasn't gone away. It's become like a virus of self-righteous individuals complaining about everything, even mundane shit. And it's not so much that they're complaining about things. Believe me, if you want to bitch about something, you have every right to do so. But people are starting to want to ban things they find offensive. Or, at the very least, have some of that content edited. Certain games, movies, books, and so on have all been under fire for one thing or another. Some people have been offended by messages or imagery and cry until their tweets run red with the blood of the self-righteous hearts on their sleeves. Demanding things be changed under the guise of political correctness. Well, who makes that decision? What is politically correct? Who, in their grand wisdom, determines what is proper entertainment for me, as an individual, to enjoy? And what gives anyone the right to dictate what one should and shouldn't create or consume as forms of entertainment? Under what guideline? And that's the thing. Why are there guidelines for any art form? Ratings? I get ratings. Fine, you create mature content, it should be labeled as such. But to start banning it? What year is this? What fucking year is this? I don't care what it is. If it is in a creative or entertainment medium, it should be protected under the rights of free speech. You don't have to support it. You don't have to consume it. You don't even have to like it. But no one should have the right to ban it. And, and don't give me that, well, this person listened to this band or played this game and it drove them to commit violent crimes. Yeah, I'm sure it was the music or game that did it. It wouldn't be the plethora of antipsychotics and dysfunctional upbringing that caused any of that mental instability. Must have been them video games. This really needs to stop. Again, I don't care what the topic is. If we do, in fact, live in a free society, then why is everyone so scared to express themselves? Why is everyone second guessing everything they say? That is not freedom. It's controlled thought through peer pressure, or if you're a creator, monetary bullying. Oh, no bully, no bully. And now, if you don't agree with the majority about whatever trending topic is happening during the day, they're all gonna digitally lynch you. You'll be unfriended, unfollowed, and branded intolerant. And before you know it, we're all right back to the blacklist again. Look it up. And as for companies, artists, creators, and so on, stop making concessions to the moronic masses tweeting out their cries of fake sensitivity. Stop changing things and dumbing down everything. This is why movies, music, games, and so on have been pretty fucking shitty in the last decade. No one wants to push boundaries anymore. No one wants to make people think. They all just sit there, listen to focus groups, and bend their ideas into some watered-down, inoffensive, middle-of-the-road yawn fest that's guaranteed to have adequate reviews and profits to match. People have somehow been programmed to just look for something to be offended by. And my theory is that because we live in such a limited intellectual landscape, people now equate being offended with being aware. Because they are offended, they feel they are now aware of social issues. And that makes them smart. So now, this warrior of justice with a self-inflated ego, thinks their views on all matters is now unquestionable and infallible merely because they feel their emotional reaction to a topic somehow makes them some socially conscious troubadour of humanitarianism. And opposing opinions? Well, they're just intolerant! It, it's the exact opposite, don't you see? By claiming your opinion is right on a particular subject and shouting down or just bullying others of opposing views, you are, in fact, showing yourself to be the intolerant one. Why is this not clear? Look, folks, life and art is not about political correctness. It's not about safe spaces or having a group of people that think exactly as you do. Life and art is supposed to be an open forum for exchanging various ideas. It's about communication and exposure to new thoughts and concepts, no matter how offensive your little white bread mind may find them. It's about growth. And even if you come across something you find offensive, that instance should allow you to grow as an individual, allowing you to accept that the world and its people have various ideas, and, even if you don't agree with it, are mature enough to accept its existence in contrast to your own ideology. It is not your place to control thought, nor gear any artistic expression to fit in line with your bland mentality. You are not the world. I know your parents may have told you otherwise, but you are not the world. It does not revolve around you. It doesn't owe you anything. This not only applies to you, it applies to me. And I've done something with my life. So, 
for the sake of all mediums of art, music, movies, games, literature, and all forms of free speech and expression, allow it to just be. Allow it to express itself. And if those ideas offend you, allow that conflict within yourself to push you to grow into a better person. One who is open to all ideas, not just your own. Life is not politically correct. And I have no idea why anyone would want it to be. If you allow everyone to just speak their mind, you'll know exactly who you don't want to deal with. It's right there. They open their mouth. They're idiots. Everyone out there wanting expressions of creativity and speech to be politically correct or monitored is basically saying, take away our individuality and make everything adhere to a set standard of rules. And I'm just going to end this on a quote. Author P.D. James once said, I believe that political correctness can be a form of linguistic fascism. And it sends shivers down the spine of my generation who went to war against fascism. I couldn't agree more. And with that, grow the fuck up. And hey, whatever comments you're going to want, you're going to put below this bitching at me about nya 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 certain kind of... I don't care. You're definitely free to post, but guess what? I ain't reading them. I'm not wasting my time. I've already wasted enough of my time trying to get the ugh, amoebas of humanity up to the next evolutionary scale, which is just... It was logical, but whatever. Just get squished underfoot. I don't give a flying fuck anymore.